Hello and welcome back for another male vs female video. Today's video it's all about male Nile Lechwi vs female Nile Lechwi. Let the best win. The Nile Lechwi, or Cobus megaceros, is a species of ungulate native to the marshes and swamps of South Sudan and Ethiopia. They exhibit a high level of sexual dimorphism. Male Nile Lechwes are larger than females, with a length of 5.3 feet to 6 feet, shoulder height of 3.3 feet to 3.5 feet, and weight of 198 pounds to 264 pounds. They have long ridged horns and their coat is of a dark brown color, with white markings on the shoulders, face and legs. The male's neck is covered with longer, bushy hairs. Conversely, female Nile Lechwes do not have horns and have a much lighter tan-colored coat. Females measure 4.3 feet to 5.6 feet in length, stand 2.6 feet to 2.8 foot tall at the shoulder, and weigh between 132 pounds and 198 pounds. Nile Lechwe are found in only two relatively small and fragmented areas and are considered an endangered species. It proves difficult to enact protection efforts as they live in areas of civil and political instability, as such hunting and habitat fragmentation continue to threaten the species despite their protection status. Nile Lechwes, like most antelopes, live in herds, which can be composed of several group types, groups of females and their offspring, male bachelor groups, or breeding harems where a dominant male gathers multiple receptive females. Solitary dominant males tend to protect a territory against other males and pursue any female passing through in the hopes of mating with them. And the winner is the male Nile Lechwi. Some interesting facts about the Nile Lechwi The horns of male Nile Lechwes can grow up to 34.8 inches long. Juvenile male Nile Lechwes look similar to females, except for their developing horns. As they age, they develop their darker coat with the characteristic white patches. In the wild, warble flies can parasitize Nile Lechwi calves, leading to relatively high mortality as the larvae feed on tissue under the skin and can cause infections. As they live close to bodies of water and spend long periods grazing on aquatic plants, Nile Lechwes are a key prey species for crocodiles. Nile Lechwes are also known as Mrs. Gray's Lechwe, after Maria Emma Gray, the wife of John Edward Gray, a keeper at the British Museum, who also proposed to classify the species as Cobus Maria. Thanks for watching.